Yo, what is up, lads and ladettes, for another Rainbow Six Siege video. Now, guys, don't worry about this background gameplay. This is just me having fun on BO2, okay? So, um, still a video on Rainbow. So, in today's video, we'll be talking about the two new operators. As you guys already know, for Operation Steel Wave, which was announced by Ubisoft a few days ago, we have two operators called Malusi and Ace. Now, in this video, I'm going to be covering everything about Ace, his ability, his loadout, everything we know so far, as well as what I think might happen with him and how his ability works. Now, if you want to learn more about the other operator, Malusi, you can click in the top right corner now, and this will take you to the other video that I did. But anyway, guys, let's get into it. Alright, so as you guys know, the teaser trailer was released by, I presume, Ubisoft. I'm not actually too sure. I found a leaked video of it, essentially. But um, I've got an HD version of it here, and um, pretty much what we can tell by this is if you just saw there, you could see with Malusi, she was sending out some sort of waves. Now, as we know, she has a pyramid device, and we actually have leaked images of that. It's on screen here if you want to look at them. But um, we're going to be focusing on Ace. Alright, so for anyone who's confused about what Ace's ability is, he's a hard breacher, and his ability is on screen here. So what he does is he places this X on the wall, which is actually his Thermite. So as you guys know with Thermite, he places a big C4 patch or whatever down on the wall, exothermic charge, and he can um, activate it from being far away. Well, how this works is with compression. So he places an explosive patch shaped in an X, so this is a, like a mirror-sized sort of hole. That's what it makes. But um, if you look at this image, he's already made the hole, and he's just putting another one below it. So what he's doing here is he's putting down this patch and how he does that is he throws this canister. If you look on screen, he's got a canister which is like a legion canister and has the same game mechanics from what I know. And it's got the Night Haven logo on it. So that is Kali and Wamai CTU logo. So what he does is he throws it onto the wall and as soon as he throws it on the wall it expands out into this patch thing. Either that, or well, that's what I'm thinking because the cracks are there so it looks like he throws it and it expands out these like metal sort of whatever those are, little support things, and forces that out. Either that, or he places that down, and then throws that or something. I don't know one or the other, but um, either way, what he does is he pops the CO2 canister, so that's like mirror CO2 canister, and when it pops, it makes the hole, so it's some sort of hole compression-based thing. But actually, when you come to think of it, if you look at this image here, that little orange thing, it looks like some sort of C4. I thought it was a C4 of some sort at first, but it could be a drill, so I think it's sort of a drill. So um, from what I know, that is how the explosive works, etc. I don't know much about it, so that is all I can break down. Of course, it's just my thoughts, etc., but I presume that's what it is. Now, if we look at another image here, you'll see there is a bigger hole. Now, the thing is, he only has two of those things. So if we look at this another image here in the bottom corner, he only has two of them. So why does he have two sized holes and get a third one? So that's what I'm wondering where, if that orange thing comes into place. So see how the orange thing's dropped off here? There's no orange canister thing. I wonder if when he throws the orange canister thing, it drills through the bottom, and then the, um, like, you know, drills out like a maverick, sort of, and then the thermite charge, or exothermal drill, or whatever, and that explosive thing blows up above it, creating a bigger hole. So obviously you can vault through this hole, which is very interesting. Everyone thought that was a ladder at first, that thing, but people were way off. What that is is that is a patch now i presume he can do hatches so bottom of hatches and top of hatches underneath the hatch so i presume that's what he can do which is very interesting and of course as you guys can see by these images he does have the ak now the ak-12 here has this is fuse's assault rifle by the way it's got the normal acog so not the nato sites now one thing people have been noticing is this might be a different variant of AK. So we have the AK-74, which is with Nomad, and then we have the AK-12 with Fuse. Now those are the two most unique weapons in the game. No one else has them, and none of them, you know, no one... So those are single weapons in the game that no one has. But, um, yeah, is this a different variant, people are saying? People are saying different railing, but I do understand for the whole side system that have to be. But I'm just wondering, if you compare this to normal Fuse ACOG, or Fuse 12, sorry, it does look quite different. Anyway, that is it for this video, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy and learned something from it. Now, I know I kind of cut it short there, but um, that's necessarily all I have, and I do not want to keep you guys here all day. So, um, yeah, if you guys did enjoy the video, please leave a like on the video and comment down in the comment section below if this video helped you. And, guys, I just want to say a massive thank you. I mean, I haven't said it lately. I didn't even really notice for some reason, but I'm at 2.62k subs, guys. 2,620 subs. Now, guys, that is an absolutely amazing goal that I never thought I would hit, personally. 
and it's just amazing to see the views coming in. I'm getting what maybe like one to fourteen thousand views per video on average. So thank you guys so much for that. It really does mean a lot, even if I don't mention it very often. So guys, the giveaway is still going. So if you haven't entered, go check out the link in the description below. Go to my Instagram and you can enter it there on the giveaway post. So it's pretty simple to enter. It'll have everything there. And um, yeah, so stay safe. And if you guys aren't subscribed, please subscribe, post notifications, and I'll catch you guys later.